hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl amaka and i'm back with another video for you guys in today's video i am going to be going on a thrift eh? i'm going to be going thrifting so basically i'm going to buy some things from the market for myself i'm going to buy some books and just things for school yes i'm finally using a mic i'm so happy my brother got it for me yesterday he actually got it for me a day before yesterday but the one he got was like not suitable for my phone so we had to change it and i'm really excited to be using this because like i don't know it's just really exciting and yes i'm losing my hair apparently my hair cuts very sad something my hair cuts and like it's just so sad actually yeah i'm going to get ready i like i'll meet you guys back when i get ready but i hope you like this video i'm going to be doing a haul at the end to show you guys like everything that i got excluding the prices but like i'll be showing you guys everything that i got Ignore see the way i'm looking next my eye bags anyhow i hope you guys like this video don't forget to subscribe like share with your friends and family and yeah i'll see you guys when i'm all dressed and set and ready to go back from the market time is around like i think to something we really took time i wasn't able to vlog a lot in the market because it's a market and it's in nigeria before my phone will go i don't have a story to tell but yeah i'm going to do the haul very soon but i want to eat and i want to do some other things and then i'll do the haul we didn't end up buying every single thing that i needed so i just going to have to wait it i'm actually like I, I buy those other things that i need and then i will show you guys the remaining things so yeah okay so i'm back i'm done with eating and i'm this close to lying down my bed to sleep because i am so tired my body is weak so i'm going to start trying on the clothes and the outfits for you guys and yeah i hope you like them well even if you don't like them like I don't know what else to say but like i like them and i just want to show you guys like i said earlier i didn't buy every single thing that i needed or i wanted rather i will not say i needed but that i wanted i didn't find every single thing i'm still going to go back again probably to a different market with my friends to just get some few things and like i said also i'm going to show you guys after so yeah plain is just like a singular color I really love flowery designs and I would have preferred it if it had a flowery design. But this is okay. I really like it. I had to buy it in this lilac. There was a pink, there was a black color, there was a blue color. But like I just wanted this color because I don't think I have any clothes apart from my old secondary school uniform that is in this color. So I'm really excited. This is the back of the dress. It's really amazing. And I think it flatters my body and like by the time my hair is looking a lot more presentable it will look a lot better like by the time i accessorize and everything so this one i would give it um probably like an eight out of ten i really like it it's not up to like what i might want but i still really like it i think it's really nice it's giving church girl it's giving modesty it's giving queen esther i just really love it yeah guys this is the next thing i really love this skirt but the slit is too high for school because i want to buy something that i can wear in school and i can as equally wear when i'm at home and like i like the slit i don't think that it's bad i, 
i think it is actually at a considerable height if that makes sense but it's so high for my school and like i don't want to talk and also the waist is too big and i've been growing stomach since i don't know where it's coming from so if i eventually lose weight it's going to be way too big for me at the waist side so yeah i really like this skirt having it right now is just really flattering and i really like it i'm going to try the second outfit no the third outfit yeah i'm so excited because this is a silk skirt i think it's from zara but i obviously bought it in the market so it's thrifted i really like it because you guys don't know how much like i never used to like skirts and i think i even mentioned it in my video like when i was getting ready to like enter invested that i do not like skirts i can emphasize it i don't like skirts but recently i've been falling in love with skirts and i think that wearing skirts is just one of the easiest ways to dress modest i'm not saying that trousers are bad like i love trousers and i'm always going to keep wearing trousers but wearing skirts is just really really beautiful i love this skirt i can't wait to try it out i feel like i'm going to be wearing it a lot of time and like i can already picture an outfit in my head already like it's just so crazy i really really love it so yeah i'm really excited and also when it's in school off to the final outfit it's also a skirt like who is no surprise at this point <laughs> So guys, I cannot begin. I love this skirt so very much. I believe that it's flattering. It's it's a wrap skirt, so it's like this. I just love it. Like, but it is so beautiful and it's really long, which is like strange for someone who loves shorts and trousers. But like, I really really love it. This is the last outfit. I'm really grateful. I really love them. I will try my best to wear them like literally every time, and I'm not even exaggerating. Like. I really, 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 really have to wear them. I just really like it. I think it's beautiful. I think it's amazing. So, yeah. Hi, guys. It's another day. Um, I went out today. Like, I just came back not long and I ate. Yeah. If you're wondering why, like, I just said I ate and, like, my lips has lip gloss. I just put lip gloss. So, I want to show you guys part of the things that I was meant to buy yesterday. But I didn't end up getting. I just got them today. They are so heavy. Like, who sent me to study something as like a medical course? This is the first thing I got. Some hand gloves, like those types that you see doctors use. Oh my god, them! Like, I think that this is even too much. So I don't really think I'm going to. I don't think I'm going to use everything. Hopefully, I have enough self restraint not to play with it because. I remember making a video with my brother during that quarantine period and we literally used hand gloves and sanitizer just for a thriller video. Yes, I think that was what it is. I didn't even think that appears is taken. Anyhow, this is the second thing I got and this is a dissecting. Yes, you heard me right, dissecting. So, I won't say I'm excited to use it, but we'll see what happens. And then I got test book. So this is an anatomy test book. It's called the Cunningham Manual. And this is one for upper and lower limb. I also got this book that looks like a, an encyclopedia. Like it's so large. How am I even going to read this? It's called Medical Physiology. Yeah, Essentials of Medical Physiology. It's so heavy. Like it's like a dumbbell. Up to another nylon. I got some Nataraj pens for drawing. Because I'm going to be um, this in drain, I think in anatomy or something. I also got some sketchbook. This is the A4 sketchbook. I just hope and pray that this is the type that we need because like, it wasn't stated. Another test book. I also got Atlas of Human, Human Body Atlas, I guess. I'll tell you, like, I'm eager to use these books because I'm not the test book kind of person, but I know that it's essential for me to use. So, And last but definitely not least, I got test book of biochemistry for medical students. This is the test book. So yeah, I'm eager to use them. I was going to use the word excited, but I'm not excited. I, I'm not excited at all. I'm quite sad, but I'm eager to use them because I know it's going to help me out. So yeah, I still have some other things. The makeup, I've been like talking to the people that I'm buying the makeup from. 
I'm just kind of been discussing and we've just been discussing so when I get the makeup of course I'm going to show you guys the makeup and everything I'm really excited about the makeup that I can say I'm excited because it's makeup so yeah bye for now so um like i said in like this video so far i'm so tired i just got back from wonders i bought some makeup and like i had to order them so i would film when i finally get them or i got it like three days ago yeah but i've been extremely tired and i've been busy so i have not filmed anything and i was waiting for the other set of the makeup because i ordered from two different people one person like her delivery was very smooth and just very good i think uh, if i remember i would post i would tag her instagram like in the description so you can check it out if you're into makeup and like you're looking for where to get makeup pro products from and the original and good so but the other person has not given me the products yet due to some issues so i see waiting on her to deliver the product but i'm just going to quickly do the haul for this one because i'm extremely tired and hungry so this is the l'oreal true match super blendable foundation i'm showing you guys before in my video but this shade is a c7 and i'm actually a shade c8 that did not sound right it's not the right product for me but i'm going to mix it up because like the makeup products i have is not just for myself it's also for customers so I'm going to mix it up it was quite expensive like the last time i bought it it was um 5k and i think this time around it was 7k or 6k or something so it has changed i also got a foundation brush like so long i waited because when i was buying um brushes and everything i wasn't the one i bought actually my mom bought from me but i also bought like some beauty blenders myself and then those foundation brush in school but I do not just want to buy from school because I want it to be authentic and I want it to be good. So I don't just want to take my chances and waste money and buy something that is not good. But I like it. I'm eager to try it on. I've never really used a brush to blend my foundation. Like I said, I did not have a brush. So we'll see how things go. I also got this liquid liner by Polar Beauty. I already tried it out. Okay, I didn't try it out. I wanted to try it out. But like I didn't want to have so much on my face. Then I got this concealer by Avor. Um, it's a liquid concealer invisible coverage i got the darkest shade that is the a90 and like i just wanted something that even when i'm doing like maybe a natural makeup or something like that like i can just put it on on my face and like it blends well into my skin but i think if i'm doing like a full coverage i'll probably be using it as a contour because i've never used like a liquid contour so i think it's going to work well because it was quite dark so it's going to work really well and last but finally not least what's wrong with my english i got a um classic beauty i mean classic makeup rather classic makeup primer and i already tried it because i have really oily nose so i the day that i got it like i already washed my face and then i put the primer on my nose and like i left it for the rest of the day before i slept and like i washed my face again and i did not sweat like it's not 100% perfect but it's like a lot better than my formal primer so now i know that my game in like makeup is increasing i'm really grateful to god i look forward to learning more in makeup more investments like more makeup and more makeup videos for you guys like i have this video in my head although i'm not making it on youtube so you can go and check out my tiktok for when i post it so you can see i love you guys and yeah i'll see you very soon again <laughs>